monitoring and evaluation stakeholders management. Under this module number two, our learning objectives are identifying stakeholders, stakeholders needs, monitoring and evaluation roles. Identifying stakeholders. Stakeholders may vary throughout the life cycle. Thus, to get a complete set of needs and subsequent requirements, it is important to consider all stages of life cycle model when identifying the stakeholders. Project stages of life include concept, development, production, operations, sustainment, retirement. For each stage, a list of all stakeholders having an interest in the future system must be identified. The goal is to get every stakeholder point of view for every stage of the system life cycle to consolidate a complete set of stakeholders' needs. Their needs can be prioritized and transformed into a set of stakeholders' requirements. Stop the video now and discuss within your team who will be the stakeholders for your project. Identifying stakeholders' needs. The requirement engineering or business analysts may implement user stories, user case scenarios, system concepts, and operational concepts. Identifying stakeholders' requirements. Stakeholders are transformed into a formal set of stakeholders' requirements. The requirements are captured as textual requirements and outputs, typically called a stakeholder requirement specification, STRS, or stakeholder requirement document, STRD. This requirements analysis may involve the use of flow diagrams, timeline analysis, diagrams, movies, pictures, states and models analysis, fault tree analysis, failure models, failure modes and effects analysis, trade studies. Stop the video now and discuss which stakeholders requirement would best fit your team's project. Classification of stakeholders requirements. Classification of stakeholders requirements include service or functional, operational, environmental, human factors, maintenance, design, production, verification requirements, validation, training, availability, security requirements. Stop the video now and discuss with your team which stakeholder requirements will be implemented in your project. Collecting stakeholders' needs. There are many ways to collect stakeholders' needs and requirements. It is recommended that several techniques or methods be considered during this process to better accommodate the diverse set of sources, including structured brainstorming workshops, interviews and questionnaires, technical, operational, and or strategic documentation review, simulations and visualizations, prototyping, modeling, feedback from verification and validation process, review of outcomes from the system analysis process, 
use case diagrams, activity diagrams, functional flow block diagrams. Stop the video now and discuss with your team what methods would you be implementing for your stakeholders' requirements needs.